All right, my friends, I am working this 2009 Kyle Busch Real Chocolate Relief Act for Kyle. And some interesting things that has come up. And I'm looking for, yeah. So check this out. This is the little piece for the lower front valence, okay? What in the world? Look at that. That's not even close to being the right size. You see that? <laughs> it's like a little baby piece. So what I did was um, I just went ahead and painted this whole bottom valence white. I actually put multiple coats of white in there. As you can probably tell. So, got that in there. <clears throat> got a lot of other pieces in. I've got to put this along here. Got the back done. Had to look at a lot of different pictures to try to get this, uh, the decals in the right place for it. But so far, it's coming right along. I've got some work to do on the spoiler, still painting that black. But I've uh, got some pieces here to put on. And yeah, just working this. It's not going to look that great, at least on that lower valence, Kyle, but um, I will try to make it look my best there. Okay. Another interesting thing I was looking at, looking at this these pictures of this car here and uh, the way the decal set came I had to cut this apart because <clears throat> the little Moog decal is actually not on the car looking at the pictures uh, it doesn't have the Moog decal so I cut that out that's why this is in two pieces here So, you guys probably know this, but sometimes when you're making a car, the decal set isn't a perfect match to what was actually driven on the track. So, you want to you wanna compare, right? You want to take a look and see. And every once in a while, you look a little closely, you might find something that is a little bit off. So... If I can get it to work, I'm going to try to merge some videos together and um, I'll show you guys a little video of me playing Halo 4 with my daughters. See if I can get that to work. If not, it'll be a separate video. But every once in a while we'll play and our one daughter's going back to Liberty. So I won't be able to play with her a whole lot. So probably get in a couple games this week before she goes back. Here. 
Sometimes that happens when you're trying to push it down. It kind of your finger sticks to it, so. Oh well. Get it back in place there. Try again. So yeah, I'm going to get this, put this in the water here and let that get ready to go on the car here. One of the hardest pieces to put on is, is what I have to do next and that's this piece that goes in back here and yeah, that's going to be a pain in the butt. So I will... Uh, I will work that off camera because <laughs> I'm gonna have to get some microsol and and really work that. Um, yeah. So this is the um, uh, the 2021 pedigree, and that's coming along well. Got the black on the lower valence here, black roof lines. This is all black. So. Pretty happy with this, Kyle. And yeah, I gotta detail the bottom as you can see, but um, pretty happy with this all together. I'll finish that up. And I'm not really gonna do anything down here on this one. Um, I I used to like to decal the black or, or detail the black bottoms, but it's it doesn't really look right. Um, and so I just put some black over the JB weld to make it match the bottom, and I'll just leave it like that. Um, yeah. So next I'll be doing these Nicholas for you, uh, decaling these, uh, 254s and yep, I'll be doing that. So hold on just a second. All right, let's try to get this thing in here get this, see if I can get this going. Got the micro sole. I think I've got it centered pretty well in here, and now it's just a matter of spreading this out. So I put some micro sole on the back side before I put the decal on, and then I pulled this away from the water and put some more microsol on top of the decal. So it's kind of got a kind of got it all around. Now I'm hoping it's just a matter of just kind of gently working it in place. And getting out the little pockets of air and pockets of water. Yeah, you got to be careful when you're working with the with that micro sole. You don't want to puncture because it get it does get it really soft. So you don't want to. You got to be careful. You don't want to puncture it, rip it. So moving it with, you know, kind of pressing in here. I gotta I gotta kind of be careful here. Pretty good. I'm pretty happy with that. Got this 
in place. I gotta be careful I'm not rubbing up too much against that. And I don't move that off of, off of where it needs to be. Looks like that moves slightly. Pretty happy with that, to be honest with you guys. Actually, I'm gonna try this. Let me see something here. This is the broken off tip of one of those little applicators. not the metal tip of the of the tweezers so I can be a little bit more direct and kind of use use that Kind of working it around those those little I don't even know what you call them little support uh, bars. They really stick out on that, and um, yeah, kind of working them around there. So pretty happy with that. All right, guys, playing Halo with my daughters, and uh, I'll show you how this uh, how this goes down. I'm not sure you can see the very top. Oh, ah, it's not good. Not a good start. Saw somebody. Just a 10 minute game. There's two. Of course, I don't like being gold. Oh! I don't like being gold, but. Come on out, come on out. I'm going to keep getting it.
I like the rate of fire of the pistol. There we go. Seven minutes left. Ooh. Whoa! Ah! Got one. Okay. Where are you, Elizabeth? She likes to do that. She likes to sneak across. Ashley. She's green. And Elizabeth is the light blue. She's playing the Bryce, the username Bryce. Nice. Tied for the lead. Oh yeah, I have sound turned off just so you guys know. You didn't notice that before. For some reason it helps me concentrate a little bit better. was I thinking? Ugh, we play this map and, and, and a lot of times I play it with, um, I have the jetpack. I completely forgot that you don't have the jetpack when you're playing SWAT. That was stupid. What in the heck is going on? Oh, there's somebody. Oh! Look away. Five and a half to go. They play upstairs on a separate Xbox 360. And they play, they like to play on the same screen so they can see each other. No! <laughs> Here we go. Everybody congregates in the middle now. She didn't assassinate me, but that was bad. Lost. All right, that's that. All right, now we're gonna try this, but um, I'm gonna I'm gonna pause it or uh, stop the video because we're gonna play another game, and I can't set this up very nicely. But anyways. That's a little bit of us playing Halo 4. God bless, guys. Talk to you later.